Yesterday, I landed on a very good looking GitHub profile and it made me realize I had no idea how to customize it. Then all the internal chat began. Come on, you Wawa Sensei, you have thousands of followers. You can't have a default GitHub profile. So I decided it's time to customize mine. Hi, let's see how as a developer you can customize your GitHub profile to look like a rock star. We will see how to do it from scratch, but stay until the end. We will also discover very useful GitHub profile generators, but also templates you can use as great source of inspiration. This is my uh, GitHub profile, I never touch it. You can just see my project, my pin project. I, I, I don't even know if I already pinned some. There is a warning saying I have achievements, so those are the achievements here. And you have my contributions, you can see I worked a lot this year, should take some holidays, accept it on, which is it, Sunday and Saturday I'm quite on a day free, but the other, day, the other days I'm working, I'm working constantly, then you have the activity, but yeah, it's there's just my description here, with, which is customized and the rest is automatic. So let's see how you can have a beautiful page here. First thing to do is create a new repository and the repository name should be the name of your GitHub account. So for me, this is was08 and they're giving you a warning of why and what will happen. So the description, wow, well, sensei, GitHub, GitHub profile page. It's public and I should add a readme file so I can edit it because it's the readme file that will be displayed on your profile. I add nothing and I create the repository. By default, they are writing here, hi there. So if I go now to my profile, which is this link in a new tab, you can see here there is the hi there I, I edited. Now let's see how to customize it. This is the markdown format, so basically you can just edit it in GitHub. Uh, you can also use some markdown editors. Let's see which one you can use online. In browser markdown editor, perfect. Start writing. You can copy past. Okay, skip. And here you have a place where you can do markdown or hello. I am a very good developer. And here it is. Um, welcome to Wow well, Sensei profile. And I can do it. I can edit it here. You can also preview, which is the same, but you don't have the toolbar that helps you. I commit. It's here. I refresh. And it's here as well. But because I am not so stupid, I won't keep it like that. I will, I will try to have a good looking profile. So let's see what option what other options we have instead of writing it all by myself and I'm not very inspired. So what I saw browsing Twitter is someone giving advice on how to customize your profile and this beautiful generator appeared and it's building very good looking profile. Let's see. Hi, I'm Wawa Sensei, a passionate um, Full stack developer from France. Maybe I will edit it later. I don't want to to bother you too much with it. I'm currently working on my YouTube content. Here it is. I'm not looking to collaborate on anything. 
I'm don't I'm currently learning a lot of things actually. Blender, 3JS, mm, next JS too. Exitura, I'm always learning new things. Ask me about React, React Native, not JS. How to reach me? Contact at wawasensei.dev. You can have a link to my portfolio, which is this one. Yeah. By the way, if you haven't seen it, it's quite nice, so don't hesitate to visit it. Hello, welcome. But this is not what we're talking about today. I regularly write articles on no, no about my experience still on my website. Fun fact, I am very funny. Programming languages, so C, yes, C++, yes, C Sharp, yes, Go, no, Java, yes, JavaScript, yes, TypeScript, yes, PHP, yes, but it's been quite a while. Perl, no, Ruby, neither, Scala, no, Python, yes, Swift, no, Objective-C, yes, Clojure, no, REST, nope, 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 so, okay. Frontend, Vue, yes, React, yes, but didn't have the time. Angular, I had just a few experience, uh, and it was Angular, it was not AngularJS. Backbone, nobody, kind of easy. Uh, Beautify, I just know how it works. HTML, Pug, Gulp, SAS, Redux, oh, Toth. Topic, Webpack, Babel, Tailwind, my lover is Tailwind, Materialize, Bulma, GTK, oh cutie, a lot of good memories, I won't check it, it's way too old, Ember, okay, Backend, Node.js, Spring, Express, GraphQL, no, no, Ray, RabbitMQ, nice, Hadoop, Nginx, OpenRST, and NestJS. Wow, I can check a lot of, of ticks, I'm happy. Mobile app, Android, yes, Flutter, nope. Kotlin, nope. I'm, <laughs> I'm a bit sad because I didn't uh, took the gap on Swift and Kotlin. Native Script, Xamarin, React Native, Ionic, and Cordova, yeah. I have some experiences. AIML, I'm not into it. I did a little bit of OpenCV for uh, student projects. Mongo, MySQL, Postgre, Redis, nope, 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 nope. I, I will try to, to do it quick during the, the video editing or you will hate me. No, I shouldn't check it. Uh, yes, yeah, so. and SQLite, okay. Data visualization, oh, I did some, it's quite interesting. Chart.js 2, Canvas.js, nope. Nope, okay. DevOps, I'm AWS certified, so this is where I'm the most uh, proficient. Docker, Jenkins, nope. GCP, no, Kubernetes, nope. Bash, Azure, Vagrant, Circle, okay. Oh, I really hope it doesn't crash because it's taking way too much time. Firebase, yes. Upright, Amplify, Heroku, yes. Framework, um, .NET. Yeah, I'm not using a lot of frameworks. Testing, uh, I'm not uh, a testing guy. I never doubt. Just much uh, Selenium. Actually, I, I mainly use Selenium to take screenshots more than testing, but it's part of the game. 
you better and nope software whoa yes okay static site so i said i'm currently learning next js next i made a tutorial on it Scotty, nope, nope. Okay, game engines. I I made some VR games and projects using Unity. I have no experience on Unreal. I see amazing results, but this is not. Uh, I have no experience experience with it. Automation, yes, that that pure and yeah, Git and Linux as well. So, my GitHub username, my Twitter username, I don't know, cut pen, yes. Okay. Okay, so what can I add? Trophy, profile top skills. Nope, nope, nope. Okay, let's see what we have. And now edit with what they generated and, and see how how the render is. Whoa, this is incredible. Now, if you look on my profile, I have this. Maybe I will try to, to spend some time customizing it, but it's way better than what it was before. Oh, the, the link is here. Okay, now I have a good looking presentation. Maybe I checked way too much um, languages and tools and I should specify only my expertise one. There's my most used language analyze on what I was working on, my stats and the rest that was already there. So I'm pretty happy. I'm pretty happy with the final results I get. But maybe you don't want to have a generic profile like I did. Let's see what you can do and what you can achieve. Okay, so here there is another um, there is another GitHub repository where you can find very good source of very good looking GitHub profiles inspiration. Uh, it was on Product Hunt, by the way, I should just go there and upvote because what they did was really good. Okay, now let's go back to it. You have different categories where you can find inspiration. So, what is it called? Mod? Anime, minimalist text. I'm curious about what anime is. So there are a few profiles of it. Let's open them. And okay. So now it's mainly animation, some links and some GIF, but the result is quite good. Here, same kind of profile. Whoa, this one has been worked out. Very nice, very nice looking. And because it's, because the way of how GitHub profiles work, you just have to click on the readme, open it in a row, and you can copy paste what they did and customize it to your profile if you like something else. Now let's go to another one. It's been very, very good. What Emily did here it looks very nice. Let's see what. Let's open some randomly and, and we will see what they ended up with. Just images, fancy fonts, icons, retro. Oh, interesting. Okay. So this one, okay, basic, but still customized. Nice. Okay, classic too. Very simple one. 
and another one here. Perfect. What I can suggest you is if you personalized yours, just go ahead and create a pull request on their on the repository where they list other repositories and add yourself so you will be displayed to other and you can share it to the rest of the people. I hope you enjoyed this video. It's been a while I didn't post a video because I was on holidays and working on stuff outside of the computer world. If you like this video, don't hesitate to put a thumb up because it had the algorithm rank better my videos and it helped the channel to develop. If you want to learn more tips about coding, developing GitHub, please subscribe to this channel to avoid missing very good videos. Thanks for watching, bye bye.